Well, the pandemic has made traditional communication a challenge, as we all know, but for the deaf or hard of hearing, it's become nearly impossible at times. For those who rely on lip reading, masks have complicated even the simplest of tasks. That's why the city of Bernie allowed a special running event today, raising assistance and awareness. The night team's Alicia Barrera brings us there. Scattered throughout Bernie Plaza Saturday morning were two things some haven't seen in a long time due to the pandemic, a community event and lips. As for many in the deaf community, reading lips is a vital form of communication. This is important because I feel like our world is just shut down and we've lost that community, we've lost that hope, we've lost that joy. This morning's run was a major fundraising effort for the group Aid the Silent that helps deaf and hard of hearing children and teens. Different blocks would go and set up for the race and so everybody spread out exactly six feet apart. The deaf and hard of hearing community continues to raise awareness during the pandemic for the use of clear face masks to understand the information around them. A lot of deaf kids have really good lip reading, so it would be a lot easier if they can be able to lip read when they're out in public. Gabby says this isn't the first time she struggled with communicating, as it was only four years ago she received hearing aids from Aid the Silent a resource that has allowed her to thrive in school. I've been getting a lot more good grades recently and um, connect to my phone to listen to music. A cause Ryan Borum proudly celebrates with his family as his son Elliot is also hard of hearing. Our goal was to, to get him to be able to go to traditional school and he does that and it's so neat. Um, he's, he works so hard and we're so proud of him. Alicia Barrera, KSAT 12 News.